Thirst is the worst. Thirst the worst, bitch. I'm Elise. I'm the president of NARAL Pro Choice America, and I am here. <laughs> Representing our 35,000 members in Wisconsin and our more than 2 million members nationwide. Pictures are pouring in from all over the country. This is a force that cannot be reckoned with. I want to honor the personal stories that have dominated the stage today. These are real people with real courage to stand up in the face of tyranny and terror and show us that their bravery and their personal stories and their love for their families will persevere. I am, I am Elise. I am a mother who will not worry tonight that my children will be ripped from me. I am a daughter who was raised in the story of other generations and other countries who were separated, and I was taught by my parents that I have a special responsibility to speak up when it is happening again, even if it is not happening to me. Even if it is not happening to my family, that the mantra of never again extends to all of yeah. my brothers and sisters, wherever they are, from my home state of Texas to the great state of Wisconsin, and that we will not let this cruel administration and their enablers in the Congress and in the state houses to hide behind a mantle of being pro-life and pro-family when they rip children away from their loving parents. bravery of these individuals being individually affected go unanswered. Those of us with the privilege to not be afraid, those of us with the platforms of national institutions must stand today, tomorrow, and forever in the future to say that we will not allow this terror and cruelty to happen and every child must be reunited with their family and no one should live in fear. And that's that I want you all to look around at each other because you are beautiful and because what they depend on is us to not believe in each other. They think that they can outlast us. They think that they can dispirit us. They think we will go home and curl up into a ball. But make eye contact. Make eye contact with your neighbors and your community members and resolve today that love will outlast hate, that courage will outlast fear. this injustice and make sure that we keep families together. Thank you very much. Subscribe, bitch!